Hey guys, are you surviving? I know, it's still pretty hot, isn't it? Hey Fifi, hey Bunny. You hungry? Alrighty, so it's still a very, very hot day. It's, um, yeah, probably gonna be hotter today than it was yesterday, actually, which is not good, because yesterday was friggin' hot as it was. It was 42 yesterday, and today it's gonna get to 44. 44 degrees Celsius. What the hell? Roxy doesn't like it. Do you, Rox? You don't like it? Rox. <laughs> He's sitting in the bed watching me pack my clothes. I um, started packing and then I realised that there's a lot of stuff that I still need to get. Um, so I have to head out in this dreadful weather and go shopping and get some things, which sucks. I really was hoping I didn't have to go out today, but I do. So yay, let's go. Let's do it. My handheld thing fell down, so that's great. Um, <laughs> that's a sign that it's really hot because the sticky thing can't stick anymore, like melt it off. <sighs> you can tell also when it's a really hot day when you go to the shops and it's quiet. Like, usually if it's a semi-hot day, it'll be packed. Like, packed full of people because they're all like, oh, it's a bit hot, let's go to the shopping centre and keep cool. But when it's a really hot day, people are like, I am not leaving my house. I am not leaving my pool. I am not leaving my air conditioner. I am not leaving here. So that's generally a sign that it is a quite a hot day. <laughs> Okay, so I did something kind of stupid. <laughs> I um, was putting the bins out and I went outside with bare feet in 44 degree weather when it's been 40 degree weather for the past three days. The pavement was hot <laughs> and I think I burnt my feet. <laughs> so um, I don't think I actually burnt, burnt them, but they're really in a lot of pain right now. So what I've done, I've made like a little makeshift ice bath thing right here. I've got water and I'm just sort of standing in the cold water and hoping that will avoid any burntness that may have occurred. I can't believe I did that. I hate packing. Most of all I hate packing for like a couple of nights because I reckon it's harder to pack for less nights than it is for more nights. Because if it's for more nights you just pack you know, a lot of stuff, but if it's a less nights, you got to choose exactly what you're packing. This is all I got so far. That's, uh, that's my bag. It's only a carry-on bag, which makes it even harder. Okay, so not that I think that it's any more than 10 kilos, but I've got to weigh this bag to make sure it's definitely under 10 kilos, but otherwise, I can't take a lot of stuff with me. Okay, that's good. It's just over half. That'll do. Alright, so what I think I'm going to do um, today is upload... Um, pretty early, so I'll probably end this vlog early on in the day, early on, earlier on in the day, god I can't speak, um, because that way I can have it uploaded and done before I head off tonight, because um, I'm staying at my parents' house um, before I go tomorrow to Sydney, I'm going to Sydney with my mum, so dad's going to take us in, and we're spending two nights, two days there. Uh, which will be good. I'm going for the open day of my university because it's in Sydney so I want to check out the actual campus and talk to some lecturers and meet some of the people that I'll be actually speaking to both on the phone and online and also find a bit more about my course and what I can expect and all that sort of stuff. I think my plan is to just upload um, like a one take on both of the days that I'm in Sydney um, because I don't really have the editing tools available to me. I've got my uh, little mini laptop here which I'll just be able to actually um, put the files, the movie file onto and upload from the hotel room but I won't actually be able to physically edit any of it. Um, so that's what I'll just do so that I can get them up on the days um, and I'll just film in between that and then maybe do like a montage type thing on uh, the Sunday when we get back. So yeah. I was contemplating trying to move this bed which is still in the middle of the land room but there's no way I can move it on my own so it's staying there and Ray will just have to sleep out here the entire weekend on his own <laughs> yep Hey Roxy girl, are you gonna miss me? Are you gonna miss you? Yeah? She's like, I don't care, I'm tired and it's hot Come here <laughs> 
Good girl. Oh, big stretch. <laughs> big stretch. Good girl. Yeah, big dog face. This is the hardest thing about leaving um, my house. I don't, I don't like going on holidays because I don't like leaving my animals. And I'm trying to find out where my cat is and I can't find him. Oi, cat. Max. There you are, Max. Where were you? You scared me. I didn't know where you were. Puss, puss. Hey, Max. You gonna miss mummy? Hey, Max. Puss, puss. You don't care. You're too hot to care. Yeah. Alrighty guys, well I might end the vlog here. Sorry it's a bit of a uh, nothing vlog today, but I, as I said, I'm just really just getting ready to leave tomorrow morning for Sydney and uh, all my bags packed. This is my corner of bags, um, including an overnight bag for tonight at mum and dad's house. And yeah, I'm hoping that it's not gonna be cold at all because I haven't packed for cold weather. I have purely packed for hot, so there better not be some sudden cool change that the weather radar isn't saying because I I don't have anything for that, so. My question of the day is what is one item that you cannot go anywhere without? So if you're packing to go somewhere, what is one item besides your phone and besides your camera? Because a lot of you probably have a camera. So besides your phone or camera or toothbrush. Besides the obvious things, just besides, yeah, the obvious need for living things in this day and age, what is something that you cannot leave and go anywhere without? Let me know. So, good morning, good afternoon, good night, whatever it is where you are, and I'll see you guys all tomorrow. Bye. Going in. <laughs> the smallest straw. <laughs> now, is that sugar, coconut, oh. or salt? Tongue, tongue, tongue. Tongue, sweat, tongue. Oh. No, salt, salt, yeah, salt. <laughs>